What's going on everyone? It's Mitch from RespectMyRegion.com. We're coming back from the 2023 Hall of Flowers down here in Santa Rosa. I'm here with a legend, man. Ca California cannabis pioneer, Luke Scarmazzo. How you doing today, Luke? Man, I'm doing exceptionally well. Exceptionally well. Great to be out here with everybody vibing, man. I love it. Welcome home, man. You helped build this industry and, you know, it's obviously grown quite a bit while you were on that extended vacation. And now that you're out, this is your, your first Hall of Flowers, man. You helped build the California industry, and this is your first time being able to experience this. How, how has the experience been so far? Um, it's crazy, man. Like, to, to think back then, like in 2004, like when we opened one of the first licensed dispensaries, to see, like, the industry of, like, what it is today, um, it's, it's mind-blowing. Like, you know, you have all these, like, different setups and these people with flour and these people with these live rosins and these you know cbn edibles and it's like it's it's, it's mind-blowing but it's awesome man i feel like this is what we envisioned envisioned way back then and it's it's lovely to see man yep. coming to fruition man so obviously recently we're released um and you got this partnership in the works with glasshouse man what are you guys doing there and what can the people look out for with that um so yeah glasshouse uh brought me on as a lead brand ambassador to kind of steer the ship um, and kind of use the resources of Glasshouse to focus towards advocacy, freeing everybody that's still incarcerated for prison, um, freeing all the cannabis prisoners, all the women, all the men that are still serving these crazy sentences that like while we're here and we're doing these hu huge events like this, right? There's literally people sitting in a prison cell for the exact same conduct. So it's an injustice that continues today. It's something that we have to change. So. Over at Glasshouse, we're going to use the resources and the, just the power of such a huge company to be able to really focus in and make a change. And then for just the average people out there, whether they're in the industry, consumer at home, and, and they you know they feel you know some sort of way of, of helping make a difference for these prisoners, what's a way people can get involved, just the average person? Um, I mean, listen, you got to change it in your little part of the world, right? So, you know, advocate. For the people that are still locked up, say their names. Say free Parker Coleman. Say uh, free Frank Rogers. Say free Edwin Rubus. You know, free Mandy. All these people that are still locked up. And then also go to projectmissiongreen.org and see how you can get involved. We got a roundup program that's going on that's going to be really huge. Um, and we also are doing like a lot of other things in different events in different areas. So just go in there, find a way where you can get in where you fit in. And listen, man, it's going to take everyone to come together to move this at the federal level because you know the, the lift on the federal level is really hard so it's going to take the whole community to come together and if we do it i think we can make a change Hell yeah man we got a lot of work to do with the 2023 hall of flowers luke scarmazzo man we this man just got free and he's already out working to free the people behind him man free the cannabis prisoners stay tuned follow more interviews we'll be back with more content